As soon as I listen on how to play Green Day Basket Case, the original recording is a half step down, aka down one fret, so instead of being an E standard tuning, it's an E flat. First part goes E5, B5, C sharp 5, G sharp 5, A5, E5, B5. Does that twice. Um, so E5 is just 7 on the A and 9 on the D. And then B5 is 7 on the E and 9 on the A. C sharp 5 is 4 on the A and 6 on the D. Then G sharp 5 is 4 on the E and 6 on the A. The A5 is 5 on the E, 7 on the A. Then you got E5 again and B5 again. Now the E5 up here is the same as. So you can go second time round down here for an E minor, uh, which is two on the A and D. If you want, you can do it like this. section that carries on from there is A5, B5, B5 so that was just 5th fret, 7th and 7th on the A. Does that twice so. Then the third time it adds a bit. E5, D5, C sharp 5. So the E5 is 7th fret, the D5 is 5th on the A, and 7 on the D, and then C sharp is 4 and 6, and then you're back to A5 and B5. And then the next section goes... So that's E5, B5, C sharp 5, which this one is going to be 9 on the A, 9 on the E, 11 on the A, and back to B5. So E5, B5, C sharp 5, B5. Then it goes through it again, second time round when it gets to that bit, it uh, goes down to the A5 and B5 after four of them. So, uh, and it just kind of goes from there. And then the last part is basically towards the end. So you're going E5, then you're going C sharp 5, A5, so it's E5, C sharp 5, A5. E5, B5. It does that four times and then the fifth time round it goes for a low E5 on second half. So it'd be E5, C sharp 5, A5, low E minor or E5, which is two on the A and D. And then back to a B5 which for this one is going to be 2 on the A and 4 on the D and G.